Hey guys, it's Summer and today I'm going to be giving you a room tour on my Maple Leaf dolls apartment which is Taryn and Brienne. And since they're the same size as the American Girl dolls, a lot of this stuff might be from AG or it's going to be the same size. And I'm not going to tell you where everything is from besides the big things like the furniture just because it's going to take way too long since there's a lot of stuff in here. So if you have any questions where anything is from or anything like that, any questions, comment them down below and I will make sure to respond to them right away. Also, if you want to see if the question's already been answered, you can look through the past comments. Unless there's too many, then you can just ask and I will answer all of them. So. Right now we'll get started with the kitchen. So right now is kind of an overview of the kitchen. And this is the Our Generation kitchen set. It came with the fridge and the main part. Up here we have a couple of pepper and salt shakers, a little piece of taffy, don't ask me why that's there, an A&W root beer cup, a little jar that you could put candies or something in, it's glass, a pitcher for lemonade, some dog food, some granola cereal, and a little mini cookbook. Then in these shelves, when we open them up, there's a couple of cloth napkins, and we also have little tiny cupcake, like doll-sized cupcake little, um, they call them candy cups, but they're like the paper. And in this one, we just have a little mini tea set, and these little sprinkle, like you could put sprinkles in them, and the lids come off, and then they have little holes if you want to shake the sprinkles out. Behind in this little, what's supposed to be a window, I drew a picture, and it's winter. And here we have a little cupcake tree or something that you can use to display cupcakes. Here's a little wallet from the doll craft kit from American Girl. Down here we have some mini tart tins. This is an icebreakers container, but I just use it as a doll size lunchbox. And we have this little casserole sort of dish or something. Then we have another one of the icebreaker lunch box sort of thing. We just have a frying pan and a soup ladle that's really big but I don't have a whole lot of soup ladles so. Then in this drawer we just have a bunch of cutlery and different kitchen items. There's some kitchen scissors, a little icing tube, measuring spoons, cookie cutters, a rolling pin, uh, forks, knives and spoons, cutlery, all a little tiny a spatula and just like a bunch of different stuff that just kind of fits in there and in these cupboards we have a lot of stuff so as you can see we've got some glasses and you know cups and we've got a little measuring cup a little cake batter beater sort of thing a strainer a metal strainer some like cake pans some plates and a mini lunch box so we move over here and just being held up by a clear um, push pin, let's see if my camera focuses, we have a whisk, an apron my mom made out of a towel, a little Starbucks card gift or a Starbucks gift card holder that's actually a little mitt and it works as an oven mitt, a pot holder, a little umbrella that was used in the People Poker commercial. Or maybe it was the purple one. I don't know. Yeah, I think it was the purple one. And a little towel. A little garbage bin. Opens up and it has wheels on it. And a little Santa Coca-Cola lunchbox. So on top of the fridge, there was a little a soup pot. A cake batter mixer. A bamboo cutting board. Some more of those little mini tart pie pans. Another cake pan a couple of bowls, or three bowls, and so those were all on top of the fridge, and then over here we have the fridge. In the freezer we have an ice cream sundae, and a carton of ice cream. And in the fridge we have a lot of food. There's some candy apples, little peaches in one of those tart dishes, um, cucumber slices in tart dishes, and some leftover doll sized pasta with chicken and stuff. Then we have this Crown Royale, which is actually alcohol in the little bottle, but I think it, the bottle and everything kind of looks like the real maple syrup and the color kind of matches, so I just use it as pretend maple syrup. A little milk um, container, some orange juice, 
ketchup and chocolate milk. And inside the packing paper, which you get in the mail, is just some butter that I made. And I just decided to put it in there. Finally, we have Julie's table and chair set from American Girl. And we also have a little dog carrier with a dog inside from Walmart. It came in a set with a bunch of stuff. There's a little bowl with a bone in it and water for the dog. A little bed. And then on here is just a trunk, a doll sized trunk full of random stuff like writing and notepads and stuff. Dividing the kitchen and the bedroom is just the Maplea. Um, wardrobe. It's wooden. And then it's just some like project bristle board um, sticky tacked on just to keep it sturdy and to make the wall a little bigger. And over here we have a little doll sized dresser. And inside it we've got a little wooden um, sort of little container. And in the container I actually have a bunch of mini erasers. So here's some mini doll sized erasers and a little mini um, doll sized paper clip. If you can see that. Yeah. I also have a mini doll sized TV remote that I made. In the next drawer, there's a bunch of DVDs that I made. And here's one in this Hannah Montana. And in it, there's the little disc. And you can actually take it out. But it's just sticky tacked onto it. So I made a bunch of those. If you want, I can make a tutorial on those. Just comment down below and request it. And here we have a little doll size stapler. Just a mini one. I got it from a gift store. Over here we have some doll size stamps that I made. A little doll size envelope. It's like for airmail because I think they just look fancier than just a plain white envelope. And a couple of little doll sized notepads. Right here there's a bin of just little tiny toys for the dolls and Taryn's dog Boulder from Mapleia. And up here we have just a bunch of kind of random stuff. There's a little trophy, a little piece of rope for a dog leash. Um, just this little fun guy. A little like Easter chick on a little colorful pink stone. A McDonald's or Burger King toy that's supposed to be like a little wind-up clock. A sort of lava lamp, sparkle lamp. A little eye cat, just some more things from McDonald's that are like little sweatshop. One of those Ukrainian dolls that has like a bunch of dolls inside of it. A TV that I made with the little um, paper that matches the shows. Again, I can make a tutorial with this. And also is the little DVD player. It looks really bad, I know. And inside is the little disc for the show. And then a little Clickets. Um, picture frame. Up on the wall are a couple of doll size posters that came in an American Girl mag. Then we have an American Girl calendar that came with my American Girl magazine. Again, it's doll sized. And just some little posters and valentines that I thought made good posters that are just on this little magnetic board that's holed up by some push pins. And then some more posters and pictures that I've made. And inside is another poster from American Girl magazine. Or actually, no, that's from the doll craft kit. And here's, I just typed up some of their chores. You want to see those? And in here they just have all of their clothes. And I'm not going to go into depth. I'll just give kind of an overview. Their drawers. And they've got all their shoes and other things. Again, this is the Mapleia doll wardrobe. Over here is a little Blue's Clues little house sort of thing. And here's their little sister from Walmart and she's just in a bed made out of a shoebox. Here's Taryn and there's Brienne on the American Girl Curly Q day bed. It's a trundle bed and it's retired and I knitted this blanket for it. And here's the Maple Leaf side table. I got it for Christmas. And in it, it's just a little book that I made and actually wrote. Another little notebook from a craft tutorial for my froggy stuff. A Claire's um, calculator that is doll sized. Um, just some random little letters and a doll sized book. There, then on top we have this little picture frame. Got it from one of the Christmas crackers and inside I put a little doll sized picture. Little doll sized telephone and lamp. The lamp really lights up and the phone does actually make sounds and ring. And a little American Girl tissue box that I got from the doll craft kit. The kits are really fun so I highly recommend them. A little laundry basket on a little rug, and a little doll-sized picnic basket. 
that I got, I think, from Michaels. This is their apartment. So if you have any questions, again, leave them down below, and I will make sure to answer to all of them. And thank you guys for watching. Um, request any tutorial videos or anything of that, or just leave me some really nice comments down below. Remember to um, rate this video, tell me if you liked it. Remember to comment, rate, and subscribe. 